All right, today I'm going to show you a new feature in the Media 2x branch that allows you to control which tabs show up on the media browser. Um, I've got my article, a test article content type here. Uh, and to kind of show you, I'll go and I have an image field using the media browser widget. And if I hit select media, it's going to pop up with the media browser. Um, by default, all the tabs are going to be visible on this browser. Um, so there we've got the upload tab. Uh, if you're using the media internet module, it's got the web tab. Um, and we've got our two library tabs. One's the default library, one's the views power library uh, that'll eventually merge. Um, but let's say we only want to allow people to reuse an image that's already been uploaded. We don't want to let them upload a new file. So to do that, I'm going to go to my structure page. That's going to load up, go to my content types, and do the manage fields for my article. And here I'm going to edit my images field. So hit edit. And here we can see that I've got my this enable browser plugins uh, checkbox set here. Um, and it says here if there are no selected, they're all going to be available, which is the default behavior. Um, but let's only let them use the view library. Scroll down and hit save. And that's going to save that field setting. Now I'm going to reload this node edit screen now that we've saved that field configuration. I'm going to scroll down again and if I hit select media it should just pop up with the view library tab which is exactly what we wanted. It doesn't quite show up properly, but we were working on that. Um, but that's how you can control which tabs show up uh, on your fields on a per field basis. There you go.